Good news. It looks like 400 workers at Dayton's mail processing center are also about to lose their jobs. Today, postal officials said they want it shut down and the jobs shipped to Columbus. Jordan Burgess is live with a look at what could possibly save the center. Right now, this news comes with a catch. Nothing can be consolidated until May, so Congress has time to look things over. But I'm told unless something drastic happens, the Postal Service seems set on closing Dayton's processing center. They're used to delivering news, both good and bad. We are very upset. Of course, we are still fighting it. But workers who pride themselves on getting things there on time are now stuck waiting. So the morale is just really, really down right now because no one really knows what's going to happen. But what is known is that if the processing center is closed, not only will Dayton lose up to 400 workers, but your mail will take up to three to four days longer to get where it's going. It's just a total shame that uh, this has to come to an end. Just another huge loss for the city. A move by Congress before May could save the processing center. But in a statement, the Postal Service says consolidating operations is necessary to remain viable. We're told the Dayton Center was already planning to ship 14 people to Columbus, but that move was blocked because of the consolidation moratorium. But come May, there likely won't be anything. Snow, rain, gloom of night to keep the bad news from the swift completion of its appointed ramp. From what they told the um, employees yesterday, they're ready to do it. And just to be clear, this is the processing center on 5th Street, not the post office itself. That will remain open. Now, one silver lining in this, I'm told the discount on mailings that businesses get here for having a processing center will continue in the near term, even if the center is moved to Columbus. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 2 News.